collection of pus that forms in the skin you know and then the boiled symptoms and signs include like a firm reddened bump uh, tender swollen uh, skin surrounding the bump and uh, number three bump may increase in size and uh, pus filled uh, head on the bump so which may spontaneously drain weep or ooze you know so antibiotics can be inadequate in uh, treating the abscess you know so uh, it may need uh, to drain uh, and the primary treatment for the boils include hot packs and uh, drainage you know so uh, the abscess but uh, but only when it's soft and ready to drain so most boils resolve on their own uh, or with uh, home remedies you know uh, now, if the individual has fever or long-term illness, uh, such as uh, cancer or diabetes, or is taking medications that uh, suppress the immune system, you know, and then he or she should contact a, a doctor, you know, if the uh, abscess develops, you know. So there are a number of ways to reduce the likelihood of developing some forms of boils, but the boils are not completely preventable, you know. And so the boils themselves are not contagious, but the bacteria that cause the boil, uh, they are contagious, you know. Uh, so you need to be careful. And if you have the abscess, you need to be careful about uh, when you are going close to kids and uh, all that stuff. Thank you very much.